Hey guys, Natrox out here. This is the medic guide for Battlefield 1. Start off the loadout, then we'll go on to tips and tricks. Alright, let's get into this. This is the best medic loadout to make you. The perfect medic in Battlefield 1. Rifle, Mondragon Storm. Why? You've got 10 bullets in a clip, 3 bullets to kill someone. It's perfect, got the overall gold ban balance for accuracy and damage from close range to far range from distance. Other ones, other rifles may have 5 bullets, but the accuracy and damage just doesn't weigh up as effective as a Mondragon. Same with ones that have 16 bullets in a clip. If 16 bullets, you think that's a lot, but damage is very low. It may take 5 bullets to kill someone. By the third bullets hit the enemy or flew past near the enemy, he's already ducked, she's already ducked and in cover and no sidearm not too important you can choose what you want but i prefer the c96 it's got low recoil it's good damage obviously if you're finishing off an enemy it's perfect it can take up four, four or five bullets you can spam it boom, 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 and the enemy's dead loadout right people may argue medical crate or bandage pouch may, people may prefer medical crate but they're point whores as you can see in the video on the right multiple and multiple allies are together two or more Maybe even one it'll work for you place it down it takes a while to get another one everyone stands in it and starts getting healed but you have to stand on it bandage pouch from a distance you can chuck it and it'll follow the, the ally who's weak and start healing while they're running off same you can place it down your floor you run into it you've got it and you can keep moving while getting healed perfect though rifle grenades depending on the situation if you're trying to get a sticky situation or you're trying to push forward and your allies aren't doing much to push and you want to keep medic maybe a rifle grenade instead of the bandage pouch to keep moving forward medical syringe not going to say much it's a must you're not a medic without medical syringe basically you have to use it to revive your allies that's the point in being a medic grenades instead of using rifle grenades probably use your incendiary grenades frag grenades or gas or smoke to push forward and to damage the enemy that's what grenades are there for and it saves you so you can put a bandage pouch on to be the perfect medic specializations new to battlefield one they are really good i haven't obviously i haven't unlocked them yet but from what i hear and what i've seen it they're perfect concealed rescue down squad mates within 20 meters drop smoke to cover their revival they drop down you and over revive them, a smoke grenade comes up, covers you, and with stimulant syringe, which boosts yours and your allies, who you've just revived sprint, sprint speed for 20 seconds. You smoke comes up, you two have 20% boost in speed, you two leg it, and you're out of there, ready to fight in the battle. So that's it, you want to use the Mondragon Storm, bandage pouch, medical syringe, and you want to use stimulant syringe and the concealed rescue to be the perfect medic. Let's start off with the first clip. Look at this, like, I run in, you see a dead body. You run over, medical syringe, up, he's up. I'm looking, I'm active, I'm sick of sick, dying, getting him like, like that, ready to be revived, seeing medic close, but you see the medic stand there doing absolutely nothing. Bandage pouch out, healing the allies. I'm standing there, look, I'm not firing. When I get a grenade, I might chuck it. As you see in a sec, look, I'm just reviving. Go now, make sure that the whole squad's there, the whole army's there to help take over the objective. Look at this, like, then they come up, my turn to shine. Revive, then shoot, kill, and then there's me. I lie back up again. Screw the area. Like, perfect medic right there. That's the basics of the medic. Keep active on reviving and that. And keep healing your team. That's what makes your team stand ground and keep pushing forward. He's off a grenade in action. This is why I don't use it. It's banging the enemy there. Like, it takes two to kill someone. You get three rifle grenades in, well, to start with, you don't regenerate unless you're standing in ammo pack like you saw there, it takes two to kill someone, you bang on him, it's, it's useless, it really is, like, if there, if there may be, if I were close and it does do one grenade to kill, maybe I would use it, but no, it's not that case now. Incendiary grenades, as you'll see here, enemies sat right at the other end, he's firing at me, he knows I'm there, I'm weak, look, he's covering fire through but he's not hitting me, chuck it, he can't see. He's just spraying through with hope to hit me. He, maybe he could, but then I just went. If I had an ally, got him cover, saw another enemy. Enemy should have really got me, but he didn't. I got out of that sticky situation because the incendiary grenade had got my ally back up. We kept the team moving forward. Here, like, honestly, like, that, them two melees, like, I'm just stood there, I could see the shadow on the floor. Use your surroundings to make it better. As you'll see here, this is my pet hate in Battlefield 1. I turn round and you'll see my two allies on the right drop. That horse will come in. Don't mind me shooting. Like, it's impossible to kill cavalry here. It really is. It's, we have taken objective. 
I don't know how, don't know why that goes. Watch, my pet hit. Hmm. Well, I'm going over, we've got reviving two allies down. This here in the bottom left or bottom right. There's a medic close. I'm Nova. His meters is going down from 10 meters. He's near me. He's on two meters. He must be on top of me. No, why spawning? There's two lives lost. Like, don't. Just don't. That's my pet hair. If there's a medic coming for you, just stay there. He's going to revive you if he's coming. Just stay put and see if he does until it says next deployment. Then hold. And then just click X when it says skip to get back in. Otherwise, you just wasted some lives and waste the medic's time when they're coming over. That's my pet hate. Please do not do that. If you do, I'm going to hate you. That was kind of a messy clip, this one. Just for you to enjoy. You'll see here, flanking. Wow, with the rifle as well. Look at this. Push on the left side. Enemies don't know I'm there. Now I'm pushing on the left flank. Taking up the German defence one by one. The enemy's defence pushing up. Getting up there. You'll see here. Look, four enemies stood together. They don't know I'm there. He doesn't know, like, got two kills, he's ran off. Like, they don't know I'm there. Push a bit further up, you know the score. Rifles are really good fit with the medic class. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. Hit the bell next to the subscribe button for notifications and upload next. See you guys next week. Nitroxide signing out.